Hey there, adventure seekers. I'm Theo Dorsey, and this is the Palm Beaches TV Now, where Palm Beach County, Florida comes to life one story at a time. This week, we're spotlighting one of our newest shows, Kids Quest in the Palm Beaches. Host Isaac Nelson is on a mission to uncover the coolest, wildest, most hands-on spots from mini golf to science labs and even falcon releases. He's exploring the Palm Beaches through a kid's eye view. First stop, a nature adventure in Northern Palm Beach County, where Isaac meets a feathered friend who's ready to return to the sky. Let the quest begin. Today, we are at Juno Dunes Natural Area. We're gonna be meeting Benji and releasing a peregrine falcon. Benji, I thought I'd find you in the woods. Hey Isaac, how are you buddy? Good, Good how are to you? see you. I'm, I'm doing great man. We're out here at Juno Dunes. Yeah, tell me about this place. It seems really cool. It is man. This is one of my favorite natural areas. I know I say that about like everyone I meet you at, but this one is super cool because Juno Dunes natural area, it actually preserves the largest intact coastal scrub in South Florida. So once we get up into Martin County, we get into JD State Park and all that, but right here, this natural area is over 500 acres, and the majority of that is coastal scrub. Wow. So this is this really hilly terrain, like the, the desert microclimate of South Florida. Yeah. But it's not just the coastal scrub, it's the fact that this natural area is the only one that preserves from the ocean. It actually has beach habitat all the way to the Lake Worth Creek Aquatic Preserve. Wow. And so you get all of these habitats in between. You get the coastal scrub, you get the tropical hammock that we're gonna be exploring today. We get the beach habitat that we're gonna go see this peregrine falcon yeah, on. I'm really excited. And then you even get down into mangrove swamp and other things. So here at Juno Dunes, I mean, you can really see it all. All right, so Isaac, Kristen, so we've got a peregrine falcon here. And so these birds are incredible predators and they are almost exclusively predating other birds. These birds do not nest down here in Florida because they nest on cliff faces. So we don't have cliffs here in Florida, right? Yeah. You ready to get this bird in the air? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. All right. I mean, this is why we do what we do. This is the best part of the job, and when, a bird, when an, any animal comes in with such a significant injury, you just don't know, and you do your best, and you know what, sometimes we don't succeed, and you've just gotta move on and hope for a better result with the next one, and any time we get a victory like this, it just feels wonderful. Next up, it's time to shift from wings to wonders at the Cox Science Center and Aquarium in West Palm Beach. Here, you can learn about science, technology, and even outer space. Science empowers kids to think critically, solve problems, and understand the world around them. It's not just a subject, it's a way of thinking and exploring that equips children for a bright and curious future. Cox Science Center is like a playground for your brain. Absolutely right. That's actually why we have a saying around here, everything is both hands-on and minds-on. We really want you thinking, but we also want you playing and touching. And this exhibit is the perfect place to do so. It's our engineers on a roll. You can see all of the different contraptions and conveyor belts and chutes and kickers. Really, it's just a playground for everyone, but specifically for our young ones. When kids learn science, they're not just learning facts, they're learning how to learn. The Cox Science Center and Aquarium in West Palm Beach is where science and discovery come to life. Whether you're a curious kid, a lifelong learner, or just looking for some family fun, this place has something for everyone. Start your journey with over 10,000 gallons of aquariums. From the coral reefs of the Florida Keys to the mysterious depths of the open ocean, you'll meet fascinating creatures like seahorses, eels, and even sharks. Well, Isaac, welcome to our Aquariums of the Atlantic. Here in our aquariums, we have over 10,000 gallons of both fresh and saltwater fish. One of the biggest tanks that we have here is our bait ball tank. And you can see we have all sorts of beautiful fish in there, including some of our Atlantic spade fish, some of our queen angels. Not only do we have these saltwater fish, but we also have tons of freshwater fish as well. Lots of different Florida gars and 
goldfish. We actually have over 50 individual species of fish in our tanks at any given time, and they're always switching in and out. So make sure you come back and check out what's new. From releasing a bird to holding out birdies, we're finishing up at Pop Stroke West Palm Beach, where Isaac features one of the coolest spots around. Today, venues like Pop Stroke are redefining mini golf as a modern entertainment experience that blends golf with dining, socializing, and digital enhancements. Pop Stroke is a one of a kind mini golf entertainment facility. We have two uniquely designed putting courses designed by Pop Stroke Greens. We feature an amazing restaurant. We have complimentary games, ping pong, cornhole, foosball. We have an amazing playground, which is wonderful for families. Pop Stroke is the perfect place for young kids. Whether you're three years old, you're 13 years old, or you're even a big kid at heart, everyone can come out and putt. It's not intimidating, it's a lot of fun. We're outdoors, we're open air, and uh, it's something that you can do with your friends and your family as well. So we have 17 venues across the country. We're in six different states. We have eight here in Florida. Florida is our home. Our corporate offices are based in Jupiter. The first venue was in Port St. Lucie. Uh, and this unit, number 17 here in Palm Beach, is our flagship venue. Uh, it's super cool because we have two stories. We have a event space on the second story and an amazing VIP lounge, which is one of a kind, featuring a pool that overlooks the entire property. We are very uh, non-traditional when it comes to miniature golf. You're not gonna see any windmills or any alligators here. We do wanna give more of a truer, traditional putting experience, but Pop Stroke has found that unique way to make it approachable. There we go, bud. Nice job. Nice putt, Isaac. I look forward to watching more of your adventures. And for families and kids looking to explore the best of the Palm Beaches, catch Kids Quest of the Palm Beaches on Destination America and anytime at thepalmbeaches.tv. I'm Theo Dorsey. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that bell for more adventures across the Palm Beach.